How to track your Udemy solo ad links with Click Magic. That's why you're on this video. What's up, guys? My name is Krishana Sykes. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I like to do videos just like this, tutorials on how to help you build your online business. So I give you different tutorials and trainings on how to do that. I also create videos on how to make money online. So if you're interested in videos just like that, make sure that you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also hit the bell notification button because that is how you are notified whenever I upload a video. Now, you may be interested in earning passive income, maybe to supplement what you're already making, or it could be to make a difference in your life, your kid's life perhaps. So you wanna know how to do that and how to make sales on autopilot, like passive income, right? So if you're interested in that, there's gonna be a link below. It's my number one recommended affiliate marketing program. It's gonna be in the link below, just like that. So make sure that you check this out. Now, let's get into, you know, how to track your Udemy solo ad links with Click and Magic. You know, I have said this over and over again, you know, to try to instill in your brain that it's so important if you're running any type of traffic at all in your online business, then you wanna make sure you have a way to track it. Now, Click Magic is what I use to actually do that. It'll be a link down below for that as well. But in regards to Udemy, you know, any type of solo ad provider that you're using, you wanna make sure that you check, number one, your opt-in rate from your funnel. Number two, you also want to check the quality of traffic you are actually getting. So what I'm gonna show you in this video is going to help you do that, as well as find out where your clicks are coming from and all that different type, type of stuff, right? I have a lot of videos on Click Magic. The one that you're seeing right now above is going to show you specifically how to use click magic and create a tracking link so let's go ahead let's dive into this okay guys here I am at my click magic account this is one of my test accounts and I've already created my link I'm not gonna go through the steps on how to create a tracking link because it's in the suggested video above so you can check that out but um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this link here and this is the offer that I'm going to send to my solo ad vendor. And this is the vendor that I chose and this is my text I already have done but I'm gonna highlight this part right here and click on the link and it already it has something in it so I'm gonna change it and hit OK. Let's say that I've already you know purchased the solo ad and the solo ad vendor is starting to run traffic to my link. What I wanna show you guys is what happens when someone clicks on that link. How does it look and click magic? So I'm gonna click this in incognito. And we're just gonna opt in to a page. And so I've opted in on the link, okay? So it's going to show the results in Click Magic. So I'm going back to Click Magic, going to save this. It's going to refresh the screen. And then you have total clicks here, one. Now generally what it says is one of one. This right here stands for unique click. So let's say that one person clicks on, you know, uh, this link from their computer, which I did then it's gonna show a unique click. Now, if I choose to click on that same link from this computer, then it isn't gonna show a unique link or a unique click, I should say, because someone from this IP address has already taken a look, which is the reason why this says zero right here. Generally, when you have, you're running your solo ad traffic, you know, you're gonna see one of one, two of two, um, unless, the same person from the same IP address starts to click on it several times, then here on the UC, it's not gonna show that person. So I just wanna quickly explain why it doesn't show one of one on this particular example. Okay, that's the reason why. But this is how you can track your Udemy links, okay, in Click Magic. You can see that it's really simple to do this. I just showed you the process. It only takes like a minute or two to actually do, especially when you get a hold of it. But the benefit of using Click Magic is it helps you to collect data. And when you're running traffic, you're spending your hard earned money to run traffic. You wanna know how many clicks you're getting for your opt-in. You also wanna know the quality of traffic 
that you're getting and you want to also identify whether it's tier one traffic tier two traffic and it helps you to determine whether or not you're going to use that vendor or not in the future so i hope that you guys have enjoyed this video that it taught you something if it did hey make sure to let me know you know drop a comment you let me know how you like this video also hit the like button share this out